A full day of hoops here on Fox. Welcome to Hartford, Connecticut in the XL Center. It's a top 18 matchup in the first meeting in two years between the Louisville Cardinals and the UConn Huskies. When you think about the experience on this Louisville roster, but not a lot of these players have experience in this type of a ball game on the road. Transfers from mid-majors now playing in the ACC for the first time. Good ball movement. The first shot taken by the freshman. And now it's the Paige Beckers. You will take it inside. Aaliyah Edwards. She can hit that shot. 15 to about 17 feet out. You know, we talked earlier about Olivia Cochran getting touches as she does right there. Aaliyah Edwards has a tendency to get into foul trouble. Missed shot. Perhaps a transition opportunity here for the Cardinals. Hard foul. Out the bucket. After free throws, after made shots, handling it is going to be key. The Edwards offensive rebound. And Edwards takes it away. Out and running. Here's Arnold all alone for another two. Kiki Jefferson, the leading scorer for Louisville here this year. A transfer out of James Madison. And the That's a long two, and Conquer at sinks it. She's seven going into this possession. That's great action right there for Paige Beckers. Nyla Harris not used to having to play off of pin downs and fade screens, and Nika Mule continuing her hot streak from three. That close out by the freshman, and Taylor hits it right in her face. Action for Louisville. You saw right away the hard show is coming on the defensive end. Look at the slip and then create the turnover. Off and run, and they want to move it. They want to transition if they can. Just one or two steps. Aaliyah Edwards is under the rim in the paint. Some paint points for Paige Beckers. Beckers no looks it. Edwards finishes it. Nina Ricards, the Florida transfer. Looking for something again. Another touch for Cochran, and you force Edwards to be active on the defensive end. Here's a look for Paige Beckers. And she looks like she's not missed a beat. It's right here, just coming off the screen. The change of pace. I think these teams want to force some turnovers. Jada Curry. Jefferson will reset. Kiki Jefferson now pulls up from 15 feet out. That soft touch. So the leading scorer here for Louisville. And she's been as <laughs> Aubrey Griffin gets out in transition. Now, now to shoot here from Mule. Griffin takes her time and sinks the three-point shot. A look for Russell. And to hit Edwards on that pass because they're not going to guard her from the three-point line. Yes, she hit one. They're going to make her hit more. Four blocks in the last game against North Carolina. From mid-range, off the glass, tough shot for Sydney Taylor. And UConn doesn't waste any time. Here goes Griffin. Transition points, count the bucket and the foul. Never satisfied. Well, Griffin coming off the bench this year, but does provide some starting experience as well, taking it all the way. Taylor goes back to back buckets. Paige Beckers as a defender, and he said a lot of people underestimate how what her length is. No one underestimates what kind of shooter she is, so. Griffin nearly lost it. Aubrey Griffin stepped her move. Look at the old change of pace. Over to Shea. Knocks it down. Three pointers wide. The cards gives it up to Curry. Here's Jefferson from the wing. Sinks the shot. Her three point shooting has making a move on Edwards. Lost her footing and turns it over. And so UConn has numbers. Here's Griffin. Strong to the hoop. It's a pin down coming back. Yes. You do it. You've yes. seen it. And the slip to Edwards. Beautifully done. Yeah, really good. Injuries to four players. Two of them starters here this year for the Huskies. Have to. Well, Jefferson going into this possession for Louisville has the last seven points for the Cardinals. Here is Jefferson. She's got the last nine. Counted off the glass. Got to keep giving her the ball. Off the fingertips. It's Arnold chasing it down for another fast break point. I and mean, those are those hustle plays, those 50-50 balls. That's the difference. Baseline take, that's tough. Nyla Harris. And Arnold looking for that screen against Edwards and feeds Edwards. Two-player game. KK Arnold making the right plays, making the right reads in that two-man. And Louisville not wasting any time. Key rebounds to go along with their 14 points. Cross it over, Griffin looking for it. Griffin staying with it. Griffin putting it through. 
11 point advantage. This is the largest lead today. Edwards adding to it. A story for UConn for the last few years and learning to adjust, learning to play with new pieces on the floor has been key. Paige Beckers picks the pocket out to Meal, back to Beckers on the transition, and Beckers is in double figures with 11. Well, UConn getting it done on the defensive end of the floor by being disruptive. Getting out and aggressive on the ball in passing lanes, able to get out in transition. That's a textbook two all season long, and they've done a great job on the defensive glass here today. A 16 to 12 advantage on the defensive boards. There's Beckers to the corner. Griffin had one three pointer today, takes it inside. <laughs> Coming from two people who played in the 90s, I think that was a great argument. <laughs> out of the timeout, there's KK Arnold. Today is arguably the toughest test for Louisville across their schedule. It's the second ranked opponent that they've taken on. Paige Peckers drills the three right through the heart of the bucket. Peckers for three. Back to back for Peckers. 20 points. You can't back off of her. Well, certainly she gives it up. You can't relax. She's going to get it back. And you have to have some sort of sense of urgency. There are a lot of players who just love to play the game who can't get enough of it, who are willing to do whatever it takes on both ends of the floor. Wayne Love breaking it up. Ricards dribbling out of pressure. And Cochran for two. Cochran sinks the jumper.